contest is a submission match. Making his way to the ring from Aberdeen, Washington, weighing 210 pounds, the WWE World Heavyweight Champion, Daniel Bryan. But questioning Daniel Bryan's success, one needs to look no further than Shawn Michaels, the man who was responsible for training Bryan. So you're giving no credit to his NXT pro, The Miz. Yeah, well, me neither. Approaching the ring from Davenport, Iowa, weighing 217 pounds, Seth Rollins. And we are hearing some love for this superstar here. And this one should be a wrestling clinic. No pinfalls here. You can only win by submission. Daniel Bryan making a move. Here we go with Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins making a move. And Seth Rollins has momentum. in big trouble. Whoa. Bam! Just when he thinks he's going the one way, his opponent takes him another. See that his body twisting and turning in a sickening way. Unbelievable! Daniel Bryan has taken back momentum. Huge shot to the midsection. Reversed by Daniel. Well, we all know Daniel Bryan can drop an opponent with any number of devastating signature moves, but a single leg high knee is a true deadly weapon. Work is being put in by Daniel Bryan. And he hits the drop kick. What impact. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Oh, what an STO! He knows his opponent is completely helpless to resist the submission hold. 
As for Daniel Bryan's signature moves, all you have to do is ask John Cena about that running high knee. That's what Daniel Bryan polished him off with in their championship match at SummerSlam 2013. Oh, back to the head, back to the temple. Avoids the impact there. No, not again. Wow, that was some reversal by Daniel Bryan. Oh, no. Oh. What an incredible encounter that was between Cena and Bryan at SummerSlam. And King. You were right. That high knee was one of the most vicious finishes of that entire year. You're right. I think John Cena is still feeling the effects of that move Daniel laid on him that night in Los Angeles. Oh. Watch it. He looks fired up here. Reversal by Brian. Yeah, that's where Brian's quickness really pays off. He was able to reverse that. And now it's Seth Rollins with momentum. And he does it one more time. He was able to reverse it and get out of that. Daniel Bryan is in a world of trouble. Yeah. Has the arms, rolls him over, and wow, this hold is locked in really good. Yeah, he's got to get the pressure off somehow. What diabolical things are going through that mind right now? When you get in control like this, you want to throw everything at your opponent. And that could be what we're seeing here. Bryan certainly had that one well scouted. Yeah, that's because Daniel Bryan is so prepared every time he steps in the ring. Up the turnbuckle goes Daniel Bryan. Incoming! Oh my, what a move! You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. There's no escaping this. I don't believe the destruction we're seeing. This guy's just going from one painful move to another. Whoa! He's measuring. That's it. He's out. Seth Rollins is looking for the decisive end. the hold. I guess he wants to try something else. I don't know what more you'd want to do to another man. And there he goes, under the bottom rope. And maybe some order will be restored here. Can he fight out? He's trying to escape. 
but the more energy he expends, the closer he is to being out. Man, Seth Rollins, what offense. Submission hole locked in. We may see a tap out right here. Great hold being applied. This is serious gut check time. That's it! The match is over! And here's some highlights from the matchup. We got a couple of highlights here. Let's check them out. Spectacular match, and here are just a few of the great highlights. Here is your winner, Seth Rollins. What a nasty hold that was. Oh yeah, you get caught in that and you have no choice but to tap out.